Le está Siete, marcando caída. Ocho, Out. Se acabó la pelea, señores. First things first, I want to say rest in peace to Luis Quiñones. Uh, primero lo primero, que en paz descanse, Luis Quiñones. Uh, I'm going to make this video mainly in English, but I'm going to say uh, some of the main parts in Spanish just in case somebody is watching this video that doesn't speak English. So, eh, voy a decir las cosas en inglés y en español, en el caso de que um, estés aquí y no hables inglés, ¿ok? So, I watched the video of the full fight. I watched the full fight, right? And... Everyone's talking about boxing's dangerous, which it is. Everyone's talking about, you know, uh, the end of the fight. But if you watch the full fight, there were so many signs, bro. There were so many things that were done wrong, bro. So, like, some of the stuff that was happening, rabbit punches. Rabbit punches are punches uh, behind the ear, like the back of the neck, all of that area. Like, they're illegal. They're dangerous. And I watched a bunch of them, bro. Not just one. People are looking at the very last one. They're like, oh, this is the fatal blow. It might have been. But, bro, there was a lot before that. There was a lot, bro. Okay? He visto la pelea entera. Y había muchos golpes de conejo. Es decir, los golpes en la nuca, detrás de la oreja. Son ilegales y peligrosos. carne en el asador o son más estratégicos octavo asalto de la pelea aquí está muñoz uy, oh, uy. se cayó y es lo que decíamos no hay caída sí. i blame the ref and i blame his trainer bro like take it how you want to take it but i blame them because there was plenty of opportunities to stop the fight okay like like, that's what you're there for, bro. Like, you're there to ensure the safety of this kid. He was 25 years old, bro. That's that's a kid. You have not experienced nothing at 25 years old, bro. Like, assuming you're going to live to an old age, that's a quarter of your life, bro. That's nothing. Okay? Si no vas a salvarle la vida a él, ¿para qué sirve? Le echo la culpa al árbitro. Le echo la culpa al entrenador de él. I'm calling it like I see it. Um, I'm, I'm gonna put the clips up of the of the rabbit punches, bro. Uh, from from round three, bro. He's stumbling in the ring, bro. And and that's just another thing too. There's water all over the ring, bro. The ref is like saying he's gonna stop the fight and he doesn't stop it. There's water all in the ring, which added to the confusion. So this kid is slipping everywhere. And maybe that's why they couldn't tell that it was actually stumbling. Because he wasn't slipping on water, bro. He was stumbling over his own feet. His balance was his balance was off, bro. protesta automáticamente octavo asalto de la pelea aquí está Muñoz Uy, oh, no. se cayó y es lo que decíamos no hay caída claro. pero esto y no esto también que se se cae sí. Sí. está festejando <risa> esto Ay, pero mucho. es un resbalón sí, ah, no, le, está le, está caída. Caída. le está marcando Siete. caída Out. se acabó sí había había agua Había agua en el piso, o sea, la lona. Y, y creo que 
creo que se, se confundió la gente, pero él estaba respaldando desde, desde el tercer asalto. Y el árbitro, el, 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 el árbitro no había hecho nada. No había hecho nada. Tiene que decir para. Tiene que decir algo. Tú eres el árbitro. ¿Para qué sirve? So, he's stumbling. Uh, the commentators make some kind of comments about it being like a skating rink because, you know, he's sliding everywhere. Like I said, I think they were a little confused because there was water all over the floor, which is also a problem. Like I said, uh, they made comments like the ref should, uh, you know, get a mop. No, imagínate cómo te asientas en los golpes, cómo caminas en puntas no. si en cualquier momento puedes resbalarte. Hace no, que cambies todo tu boxeo. No, pero puede haber una caída. ¿Dónde que se va a ir a... Eso ahí. Está muy resbaloso el ring. Sí. Está mucho plástico. Pero el referee puede pedir que lo limpie y detener las acciones. And, and clean up the ring, which he should have. Stop the fight because of the water or because of his condition um, or because of the rabbit punches it should have been stopped for a lot of reasons bro like like your job as a referee your job as a trainer all of these people that are not the fighters it's your job to protect them it's your job to protect them when they're in there bro they're fighting and that's why i'm not blaming the fighter i'm not blaming uh jose muñoz I'm not blaming him for his his rabbit punches. I'm going to assume that he wasn't doing them intentionally. I don't know that. But it's not up to him to stop the fight. It's up to the ref. When you're in there, when, you, when you're fighting, sometimes you're not aware of everything. Maybe he thinks he's hitting them right here, but it's actually landing right here. It's up to the ref. It's up to the trainer. It's up to other people to stop that. You know what I'm saying? And so... Eh, no lo he hecho, no le he hecho, no lo he hecho, pff, no le he hecho la culpa a José Muñoz, porque él estaba, él estaba luchando, él estaba peleando, y quizás, no sé, no sabía, él no sabía qué, qué estaba haciendo con las, o con los golpes eh, de conejos, pero es... Es el, es el trabajo del, del árbitro. Tú tienes que hacer algo. Anyways. I don't want to talk about this a lot. I just wanted to put the clips up of the rabbit punches. I just wanted to say this is preventable. Um, and it's not just boxing. It's not just getting punched in your face. Yes. Repeated head trauma over time, obviously, um, does damage. But it's this kind of stuff. We've seen it before. We saw it with Preacher Colon. Lo hemos visto con Preacher Colon. I'm sure you understood that in English. But uh, we've seen it before. We know what happens when people get hit in the back of the head and no one stops the fight bro i'm trying not to cuss i'm trying to get better at not cussing we've seen what happens we got to do better y'all i say we because like we're watching it it's 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 entertainment you know what i mean if we if we watch it as entertainment we don't say something to me like we're contributing to it like <laughs> nah bro like that's not what i watch it for i don't watch it to to see people brutalized you know what i mean entiendo que Entiendo que los peleadores son entretenedores y las peleas son entretenimientos, pero no quiero que sea así. Es injusto. Él era un niño. Con 25 años no ha visto nada en la vida, brother. Mm -mm. Es injusto. Anyways... I just wanted to I just wanted to show those punches and clear some stuff up. 
just give my opinion on it. I really don't talk about boxing on this channel that much. But if you follow me on other social media, you know I I watch like every boxing fight in the world, bro. If it's if it's being streamed or televised, I'm watching it. Um, I just don't want to start another YouTube channel, and I don't really think boxing fits on these on this YouTube. Um, but in this case, because it's a real life topic, I think. Uh, because I'm talking about protecting. I'm talking about a topic that's bigger than boxing. I'm talking about looking out for each other. This is a community thing. This is a humanity thing. That's the only reason I put it on here. So I won't be doing like fight commentary on here or anything. But uh, if something like this happens, I think this is bigger than boxing. I think, like I said, it's a humanity thing. We got to look out for each other, man. So I hate seeing stuff like this. So anyways, if y'all need anything clarified... Uh, leave me a comment, ask me a question, I'll answer it. Si tiene pregunta, déjame saber y ya. Thanks for watching, peace.